What did you get? Not much choice. What else was there? Dessert? Yeah, a few cakes there. It's not lost this time. I made it. Okay, it is 10.30 uh, Hawaii time, which means it is 2.30 a.m. back home. We are very tired. We had a very long travel day, but we finally made it to our Airbnb. This is the space. It's actually a lot more spacious than we had thought. So I'm standing at the foyer right now. We have a little entry table. This is the living space. There's a couch, chair, TV. There is a dining area over here. They left us some treats and water, which was very nice. And then I haven't actually looked over here yet, but I believe it's a full kitchen. Yeah, and we have a full kitchen. So there's a full stove, microwave, uh, sink, and a full-sized fridge. And I don't know what the view looks like outside because it's so dark, but I will see that tomorrow. So this whole wall is just floor to ceiling windows. I'm excited to see the view tomorrow. You can't really see too much right now. What's out here? Oh, wow. You get a really nice view of the distance. This is our bedroom. It's a cute little space. There's more windows. And this is our bathroom. And shower. And toilet. So we are very tired, but I think we are going to try and find some food if there's still anything open at 10.30. Good morning. This is our view from our room. The camera really doesn't do it justice, but it is unreal. You can see there's Diamond Head. That's cool. It is our first day. So far, we've had a pretty great day. I'd say we're pretty tired today from just the whole day of travel, but also last night, there was something going on in our building. At 3 a.m., there was an alarm going off that was telling everyone to evacuate because of an emergency. So we were getting ready to evacuate. As soon as we were about to leave the building, it um, turned off and then Throughout the next two hours it happened again like four times so that was really weird we ended up 
not having a great sleep obviously I think we got like four hours of sleep so we're a little bit tired but today we're just taking it easy we're hanging out in Waikiki having a beach day taking care of this pastiness and we might go to Costco after to grab some groceries for the week I don't know what else we're gonna do today it's still really early in the day it's only 11 o'clock and it feels like we've been up for the entire day already so we'll see where the day takes us how do you feel if you had to describe it in one word joyful <laughs> we have our snacks Korean barbecue pork bits really good highly recommend we also have some dried fruit. These are kiwi chips. There are kiwis, pineapples, and dried coconut bits in here. And we have these same brand orange chips. These are interesting because they're dried oranges but with the peel. now I'm filming on my phone because I forgot the camera in the car but we finished the hike it was beautiful it was extremely hot today is um, 
like no clouds in the sky, straight sun. There was no shade anywhere in the walk. So it was definitely quite warm. So now, oh, oh my God, there's a Okay, back. There was a wasp and that was terrifying. But I think I was saying that the hike was beautiful. There was just absolutely no shade. So I had to dump like half of my water on me throughout the hike just to stay cool. But now we are at, what beach are we at? We don't know what beach we're at. We're at a beach that is nearby on the west side of the island, northwest side, and it is beautiful. So yeah, we're just hanging out here for a bit. Kind of hungry, haven't had lunch yet, but we did go to Costco yesterday and we got these. This is a Japanese party mix. Gucci corn square, rice square, corn cereal, pretzels, and cone chips and almonds. Looks something like that. They're really good, but now I'm terrified to eat them because I'm pretty sure that's why the wasp is here. Beautiful though. I look kind of crazy. It is a lot later now. I think the last time I filmed was when we were at the beach hanging out still. It's now eight o'clock. We got back to the room at around five. We had planned to go out and watch the sunset on the beach, but I in fact made a dire mistake, which was that after a day of barely eating, I decided to chug a latte flavored protein shake that for some reason I thought was just flavored as a latte, but it was in fact the equivalent caffeine content of two coffees. And if you know me, you know that I have quit coffee now for almost a year because it causes really bad anxiety for me. So I have just been in the room for the last three hours thinking I'm gonna have a heart attack. So Chris ended up going to, where did you go? Margar Maguro Spot. Maguro Spot. It's a place that's a few blocks down. It is owned by a Japanese family, I believe, and they specialize in poke. What is in it? Salmon, tuna, and I think they, I think it said like blue marlin or and blue it looks like there's bin maybe? I don't know if it's actually marlin. It looks like there's avocado and cucumber and seaweed. It looks so good. Taste test. The sauce is a, a special teriyaki. Sauce. Oh, is it better than the one I had yesterday? It's, Honestly. Yeah. Really? It has a little bit of spice to it, but um, definitely more fish and you get rainbow.